Hello and welcome back to AI series of Explore Bio with Dr. Abhishek. And today I will share with you six free to use AI tools that will help you summarize your research articles, websites, blogs, or books for free. This will help you save a lot of your time reading the entire content. So let's begin. The first tool is Quillbot. Just select the paragraph option to summarize the content. You can choose to select and vary the summary length as per your need. Or you may choose to get the summary in the bullet points. At one time you can summarize 1200 words. And for using custom features you need to upgrade to premium version. The second tool is EditPad. You can visit editpad.org and similar to Quillbot, you can choose to customize the summary length. It has a word limit of 1000 words at a time. The third AI tool to summarize the content is Gravity Write. It has several useful features. One of these is Book Chapter Summarizer. You can summarize lengthy content too, but it may take some time. AI Summarizer is another useful and easy to use AI tool for summarizing the research articles and chapters. It also has the option to customize the summary length. You can directly copy the summarized text or you can download the summary file in various formats. Another AI powered tool is UPDF. It lets you upload any of your document and summarizes it. You can also ask specific questions related to the uploaded text and it will provide suitable answers to it. Last but not the least, you can always use ChatGPT to get summary of any text you want. You can further ask to limit the summary length as you want. The major advantage of using ChatGPT is that even with the free version, you can summarize as much text as you want. You can customize the prompt to get the customized summaries. So that's all for the today's video. Do check out my other videos on doing literature search, improving grammar, detecting plagiarism, paraphrasing using AI tools. They will definitely help you reduce your efforts and making academic writing much easier. Comment below which of these tools you find most useful. Please share if you are using any other AI tool that might be useful for others. Thanks and see you in my next video.